So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and then type in check for updates. Click on it. Now once you run this, you want to click on check for updates and do the updates to your computer may have. Now for the second step, you want to head over to search again and then type in device manager. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to expand display adapters. Then you want to right click on your graphics card and then click on update driver. And then click on search responsibility for drivers. Make sure that the best drivers for your device have been installed. Now once you do that, I'm going to leave three links down below for NVIDIA, AMD and Intel. You want to download the software that comes with your graphics card. So if me have an NVIDIA graphics card and I've got GeForce Experience downloaded. Now once you're on your software, you want to click on the drivers tab and then click on check for updates. Make sure the graphics card drivers are fully up to date. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and then type in File Explorer. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on this PC. Then you want to find where your Fortnite installed. So if you miss on my C drive, scroll down. Program Files, scroll down again. Epic Games, Fortnite, Fortnite Game, Binaries, Win64. And then you want to delete the Easy Anti-Cheat folder. So just delete this and then click on Continue. And then once you delete that, you want to head over to the Epic Games launcher. And then you want to find Fortnite. You want to click on the three dots, click on Manage and then click on verify, which will then add in a new easy anti-cheat folder. Now once you complete all the steps in the video, you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.